In July 2024, the British Army showcased its latest artillery advancements during Exercise Scorpion Longbow, deploying the new Archer Artillery 8x8 self-propelled howitzer for the first time on UK soil. This significant milestone was marked by the participation of the 19th Regiment Royal Artillery, specifically 5 Battery and 127 Dragon Battery, while 28-143 Battery continued to operate the traditional L-118-105 towed light gun. The British Army's acquisition of the Archer Artillery System was finalized in 2023 as part of a swift procurement strategy to replace the 32 AS-90 tracked self-propelled howitzers sent to Ukraine amid ongoing geopolitical tensions. The deal involved the purchase of 14 Archer 6x6 mobile howitzers, scheduled for full operational capability by April 2024, with the first units arriving in the UK in October 2023. This interim solution aims to fill the gap in artillery capabilities until the mobile fires platform is delivered later in the decade. Negotiated between the UK's Defence Equipment and Support DNS, and the Swedish government, the contract was completed in a remarkable 48 days, marking it as one of the fastest acquisitions of a complex military system in UK defence history. While the total cost of the deal was not disclosed, it included logistic support, ammunition and training packages alongside the 14 artillery systems. The Archer Artillery System, developed by BE Systems Bofors, boasts significant advancements over the AS-90, notably in range and mobility. The system can fire conventional rounds up to 30 kilometers away and over 40 kilometers with base bleed ammunition, with precision-guided munitions such as the Excalibur shell extending its reach to 60 kilometers. The automated loading system allows for three rounds to be fired within just 15 seconds, with a capacity to hold 21 rounds ready to fire without manual reloading. Weighing in with a minimal crew of just three to four personnel inside an armored cabin, Archer provides enhanced protection against small arms fire and shrapnel. Its wheeled chassis ensures excellent mobility, enabling rapid redeployment across various terrains, while its shoot-and-scoot capability enhances survivability by allowing quick repositioning to evade counter-battery fire. The deployment of Archer underscores a significant transition in the British Army's artillery capabilities. While 5 and 127 batteries have integrated the Archer system, 28-143 battery continues to rely on the older L-118 light gun, illustrating a phased approach to modernizing artillery assets. This shift was largely driven by the necessity to replace the AS-90 units sent to support Ukraine, reinforcing the UK's commitment to maintaining NATO readiness and operational effectiveness. Exercise Scorpion Longbow provided crucial training for personnel to adapt to the operational practices associated with the Archer system, enhancing the Army's artillery proficiency and alignment with NATO standards. The successful integration of Archer improves interoperability with Allied forces paving the way for more efficient collaborative operations in future missions. The introduction of the Archer Artillery System represents a forward-looking strategy for the British Army as it seeks to address evolving global security challenges. The modernization efforts not only bolster the Army's firepower and efficiency but also ensure its readiness to meet both current and future operational demands. As the British Army continues to roll out Archer across more units, the incorporation of advanced technology into its artillery regiments will significantly enhance its defense capabilities, ensuring that it remains a formidable force within NATO and the global military landscape.